Yeah, so this is a Cooler Master SFX 850 watt PSU. Basically, this is supposed to be like a Cooler uh, Corsair SF 750 watt competitor. So I don't know if I said it incorrectly. A little tired and hungry and angry. Cooler Master SFX 850 watt gold. I got this because I thought it would compete against the Corsair one, and it's supposed to cost like 140. I got one for my cousin. I got one for me. The Cooler Master charged me 145. Probably tariffs, right? But then um, they also just happened to lower the price back to 140. So I guess I'm part of the 145 batch. Anyway, I thought this would be great hooking up a motherboard. You know, GPUs, and uh, I was gonna run two GPUs off this and the motherboard with uh, an i3 and um, so that's below 850 watts load and um, it, it turned off uh, the other time I tried booting it with just one GPU it turned off and then um, it's just it just doesn't turn on I have to flip the power switch like three times and I have to pull the cable up plug it back in and it just it just won't turn on I'm pretty sure there's something wrong with this uh, power supply it's, it's a piece of shit so first Cooler Master SFX uh, I had issues I'm not gonna buy another one so yeah I don't give a shit you really don't realize like saving $30 isn't worth it at all when you have issues. And I understand I can handle 850 watts on load, but um, I'm, I'm just going to buy a, a Corsair one as soon as it comes out. A uh, Corsair 850 watt SFX. You know, they have that Titan in China that's an 850 watt uh, made by Great Wall. You know, the same people who make the Corsair SF750 Plat. So I'm expecting that 850 to come anytime soon. So uh, I have uh, custom cables for... Of course, there are power supplies as well. So yeah, just a little update. This is a piece of shit, and they'll buy this. My cousin right now is installing his, and uh, we'll see if his has any issues. But yeah, yeah, I'm not touching these again.